Tinubu's declaration as Nigerian president by INEC is the light robbery by Ayo Adebojo as he reviews next step of action. Hi guys, welcome back to Prospect Channel TV. Thank you for always coming out here. If you are just joining us, please kindly subscribe and don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Thank you once again. May God Almighty prosper you all. Amen. Tinubu's declaration as Nigerian president by INEC is a daylight robbery per Ayo Adebajo. Per Ayo Adebajo, the leader of the Pan Yoruba Social Cultural Organization, Afina Ferry, says the February 25th presidential and national assembly elections, as conducted by the Nigerian Independent National Electoral Commission, first shots of a democratic process. Sahara reporters had earlier reported that the Independent National Electoral Commission declared Bola, Bola Ahmed Tinubu of the All Progressive Congress winner of the Saturday's presidential election. According to INEC official results, the 70 years 70-year-old Tinubu came out tops in 12 of Nigerian's 36 states and secured significant numbers in several states to claim the highest number of votes to defeat the main challengers. Atiku Abubakar of the People's Democratic Party and Peter Obi of the Labour Party, who came second and third place, respectively. Why Tinubu pulled a total 8,791,726 million votes. The 76 years old former vice president, who has now run for, run for the president six times, secured 6,984,520 million votes. And Obi, who is who in less than a year galvanized young voters in a manner some have described as unprecedented, finished the race with 6,101,533 million votes. It had been reported that reaction has continued to trade the election which both local and international observers had described as falling below standard and lacked transparency in all year six. The election was largely characterized by vote suppression, tawdry, manipulation of results, which led to the electoral empire breaching its set out guidelines for the election, which stipulated that the Modern Voter Aggregation System, BIVAS, as electronic device designed to read permanent voters' card, PVC, and authenticate voters, which would be used for aggregation and uploading of polling unit results. However, that did not happen in the election, as INEC Chairman Professor Mahmoud Yakubo said that they had a glitches with the system without providing any specific. By reacting to the declaration, the former Lagos State Governor Tinubu as the president-elect in an interview with Arise TV on Friday, Pa Ayo Adebajo described the results as the election as declared by INEC Chairman Professor Mahmoud Yakubo as simple as daylight robbery. The other statesman who supported the Labour Party presidential candidate, who came third in the INEC results to challenge the results in court, said the declaration of Tinubu as the winner was only tempora, tempor, uh, temporary. For Ayo Adebajo, Tinubu's victory was Peric victory. <laughs> As of that election, there was no result. What they have done to Tinubu is like what they did to 
the interim government of Shonekin. It was very victory allowed at, as the leader, presidential candidate of the Labour Party. Peter Obi said, we will prove it in court. I listened to the chairman of ANEC when Dino Milaye told him to suspend the results because of a lot of irregularities. He said, why don't you let us correct them before we proceed? He said, no, but ANEC chairman said, let me complete this exercise and I will review. This is a daylight robbery. The whole country supported you, INEC chairman, to amend the electoral law and you promised to transmit the results by electoral means. You now went back to what we have fought against. What a shame. This government is a disaster, Adebajo said. If you call it a disaster, <laughs> it's, it's like you don't mean it. Because this INEC, they spent a lot of money. He, he, he prepared for this election more than four years, more than three years. But what happened? What happened? What we were being afraid of still came to eat us up. After telling us that the, that the, the use of beavers will make everything smoothly. See, let me tell you guys something. Hadn't been INEC did the needful, say maybe say last last, Peter will be knock on the wind like this. And INEC actually, you know, did the needful. Do you think anybody will be saying, I want to go to court? You just have to accept your results. But this one, there is no way they can accept this because there are, there, there are so many irregularities, you know, violence, shameless politicians sending talks to pulling units to, 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 to disrupt the elections and all that. So many people could not cast their votes. INEC did not even check all those ones because Obas and Joe give them advice. Make we do the needful. They say it's making incisive ways. Any government who do not listen to the voice of the people, do always they fail. I'm dropping it here, guys. Kindly share your thoughts below the comment section. Thank you for listening.